Hello Pisces and welcome to my channel where things are always real, righteous, and raw, okay? Please like, share, and subscribe. If you're new here to my channel, again, welcome, welcome, welcome. And if you are a veteran here, um, welcome back, okay? So this is going to be a channel message for my Pisces, my mermaids, my fishies. Pisces are placements, okay? Take what resonates and leave, leave the rest. If it's not for you, it's just not for you, okay? I'm hearing um, Queen Nausea, Karma. Whoa. Oh no, that's Mama's hand. But also Karma. So some of you may have experienced homelessness at one point or another. May have even been part homeless with a partner at one point in time or in a past life. If you're interested in your personal session, what is going on? I found it like this in the last reading. If you're interested in a personal session, please click the description. Please click clink oh my goodness i'm tired please click the link in the description box below okay i was up late last night energy is different different last night okay so holy spirit thank you so much for waking me up out of my bed so that i could be a divine light vessel everywhere i went today Anything that I choose to do with my energy. Thank you so much. May all my archangels, ascended masters, ancestors, spirit guides, elementals step forward at this time and help me to relay these messages to the Piscean Collective. Allow me to channel clear and concise messages for what it is that they really need to hear at this time. I'm really feeling a strong pull and some of you are exhausted because i just did a reading for y'all i'm trying to fill you guys up with a lot um because i feel like you need it but i was not this tired in the last one so some of you um also i'm channeling some of you smoke a lot of weed and spirit wants you to chill out a little bit just take a little break like, you don't have to stop cold turkey, but it's, it's I hear, I'm hearing it's lowering your vibration, keeping you complacent. Okay, so, let's see what spirit has to say. The wound is the place where the light enters you. So, some of you are deeply wounded. Friendships, I'm hearing betrayal around friendships, the workplace. Ten. Oh, I just bit my tongue. Oh, somebody may have your name in their mouth because I just bit my tongue at the workplace. Mm, okay, Ten of Cups, Eight of Pentacles. Hmm. All right. Some of you are really trying hard at this time to keep a happy home, to keep peace within your home, working very, very hard, and you are going to be receiving a lot of um, harvest, like seeing the fruits of your labor. Hmm, clarify this Ten of Cups, Spirit. The hangman. Okay, so there's something that um, you're either not seeing or that spirit would like for you to switch your perspective on when it comes to your household, um, your your family. Okay, 
um some of you may be trying too hard and spirits like if anything has to be forced that much is not you need to pull back your energy because at this point you're drained and i was very tired it lifted a little bit but in the beginning i felt like high off weed or some and like like just tired like drained I'm, I'm also getting somebody may dangle like certain things in front of your face to make you feel bad or like to gaslight or I don't know. Clarify hangman. Spirit, clarify the hangman. Thank you. Two of wands. Okay. So yeah, I feel like somebody plays with your emotions. And that's why Spirit wants you to pull your energy back because I feel like this energy that I'm picking up on is like somebody dangles certain shit in your face or like gives you one type of energy and then pulls away and gives you another one and then pulls away again and then just like stares at you. Like, I feel like, I don't know. There may even be a lot of people like looking into your relationship or just like wondering about your relationship wondering how it's working or curious and nosy about your connection the fuck clarify the eight of pentacles or like yeah like um, somebody thinks they're like higher up or higher or better than i'm hearing mama like this may be a mother figure or something Seven of Swords and then the Hermit. Mm. Yeah, so I feel like you, there's something that you really need to pay attention to at this time. Somebody may think that like, like they getting away with some shit, but shit's about to come to light is what I'm hearing and getting. Yeah, the artist. Like, there's some proof being left behind. Justice. Yep. You're going to be receiving justice. The tower. So, yeah. Somebody's trying to, like, avoid a tower moment. Or they think that... They think that they can't... They think that they're not going to receive any consequence for their actions. Because in the past, and a, in, in a lot, when it comes to your connection, whether, you know... This is home. This is family. This is a significant relationship. I feel like you've, you've, you've let shit slide in the past. You feel me? Like you've never really, like I feel like your viewpoint is like, why do I have to suffer or why do I have to withhold sex or why do I have to do this and that because you fucked up? Like at the end of the day, you're a woman scorned. I feel like, and for some of you, it's like you you pre warned and told this like, it's like this person refuses refused to let you go or like it's like you didn't want to walk away based off certain circumstances or what have you or whatever it was and like this person wasn't willing to walk away either because they were selfish and now this 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 relationship is basically because they did something that you accepted or you didn't really like show no consequence or you didn't really you lack certain self-control and self-respect in this situation it was like you've taught them how to treat you and ultimately the way that they treat you is not what you deserve so they think that they're about to get away with something or they're gonna get away like basically it's like they think that they're gonna continue getting away with the behavior so like there's no reason for them to change because what the fuck they need to change for if they continue getting the same response right and then we've got the four of pentacles and then the three of pentacles so somebody um Somebody may be talking about your finances to other people. Hold on to your money at this time. You need to invest in yourself as far as like guidance. Some of you are going to be purchasing and getting a reading to find out more because I feel like there's like three people, three different energies ten of pentacles at the bottom yeah discussing certain finances like yeah nine of swords like there may be pe the devil oh my goodness there may be people like 
trying to fuck with your money or some of you may have been like up as far as finances goes and then out of nowhere shit just started like plummeting going downhill we've got the devil yeah because you've got you've got wounds there's things that I just heard birthday cake. I feel like this person antagonizes you, picks on you, and you're extremely sensitive. So it's like, yeah, high priestess, listening to your intuition, secrets are going to be coming to surface. This person thinks they're about to get away with some shit, and they're not. Like, you're... I heard, I just heard, when you're silent, that's when you need to worry. It's like, you're about to be moving very differently, Pisces. Capricorn energy. Yeah, I feel like this person is like a bully. And again, like, this could be family. Significant other. I'm hearing you may be winning a case or something. Knight of Wands. Yeah. Yeah, three, three, something about three people. Like, clarify the devil. Some of you are like going through a lot of anxiety and depression at this time covering your face, like crying, can't sleep, I heard insomnia, mm -hmm. judgment, yeah, I feel like you've been receiving downloads from your ancestors in your sleep, you have ten of wands weighed down, you are weighed down, and we've got the magician, somebody may be doing magic, Black magic. Carrying a heavy load. Some of you may even be having random like back problems. Back pain. Back issues. And it's like out of nowhere. Like somebody's about to receive a lot of judgment for this though. A lot of judgment bruh. That may be what they think they're going to get away with. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, it's going to it's gonna fuck up their money. Maybe that's... Oh, that's what I'm getting. Three people. Somebody's been, like, spending a lot of money trying to fuck with your money. Fuck with your happiness. Fuck with your sanity. Fuck with you in general. And this is less... This is going to leave somebody out in the cold. I just felt a, a wave of cold air. Four of Wands, the Empress, yep, okay, okay, yep, yep, Six of Wands, somebody was on, is on their high horse like a motherfucker, and they're about to get knocked the fuck off, this home is, is not happy, <laughs> and this is all for your growth, we've got the Chariot, then we've got the Star clarifying, We've got the Chariot clarifying the Empress, and then the Star clarifying the Chariot, and then we've got the Ace of Wands clarifying the Star. A wish fulfillment. You're about to be, yo, like I said in the beginning, your harvest, the fruits of your labor. Wow. Hmm. Some of you are going to be traveling to like a body of water, somebody connecting with water, getting in the tub, feeling good and unfazed by this. It's all about how you react to this shit, react, how you react to this information. And your roots, like you have deep roots. And when I say that, I mean, like, you've got deep roots in a sense of, like, your your blood is, is very magical and beautiful. Like, 
empress, like so fertile, so so beautiful, so pure sacrifice. Yep. Twenty-six. I mean, maybe twenty-six years old. Okay. Maybe a life path number eight or born on the eighth. River woman, twenty-three. Thirty-seven. The mountain. Okay. So, some of you are going to have to make a huge sacrifice. Um, <sighs> Fern, number nine, okay? There may have been something that happened at age um, transformation. Some of you may have gone through something at the age of nine that really has been stuck with you ever since that age. And I did say eight. Eight and nine are significant years for you. Eight, nine, ten, because we've got 26, which is um, eight, nine, and then seven plus three is ten. So those ages are very, very significant. And then something may have also happened at age five, okay? But you have, coming up, there's some sacrifice that you're going to have to make. A path that you're going to have to take. It may not be one that you feel you're equipped to take. One that you may feel you don't have the strength for, the courage for, the will for, the finances for. River Woman. I'm going to read that out of the book for y'all. Sight of an Owl, 28. So 23, 26, and 28. So look out, there. my palm's itching. So I'm getting like, these are going to be years, 2023, 2026, 2028. From 2023 on to 2028 are powerful manifesting years for you. You're going to be receiving the fruits of your harvest at those times. Um, yeah, but something to say, read River Woman out of the book. A river woman is in touch with the shifting currents of her soul. She embraces life as it comes. The gentle flow, the dammed up blockages, and the perilous rapids. How can she stay calm among such change? She knows every situation, no matter how challenging it may be, is in favor for her highest good. Every fear is an opportunity for her rise. I was just saying this in the other Pisces reading. Go check it out, y'all. Every obstacle is a chance for her to grow, and every blessing is cause is cause for celebration. She can flow through her life like the wisdom of the earth's ancient rivers, dancing and sparkling, secure in the knowledge she will find calm waters again. When River Woman runs into your reading, she reminds you to trust the journey mapped out for you by the universe. You may feel trapped in rushing rapids, hitting rocks at every turn, or you, or maybe... You are at a fork trying to decide which way to go next before you are swept one way or the other. Trust that the universe knows your intentions. You are on course to reach your desires and you are exactly where you need to be. This is everything I was just saying in the other reading. Your sight is limited to the stretch of water immediately before you. The universe sees the entire river from the mouth to the tributaries and forks all the way to the sea. Now is the time to have faith and gather strength for the journey ahead. I just said that. Mm -hmm. Sacrifice. Fill in this time with journaling, gentle exercise, meditation, or creating for the sake of creation. Hmm. When you pull this card or when you need to remind yourself that you are guided and that everything is as it should be, recite this affirmation 11 times. Each time you say it, pour a little more trust into your words until you are strong enough in your convictions i am where exa i am exactly where i need to be i am guided at all times in my journey i am heard by my spiritual team and i am exactly where i need to be thank you so much spirit so much beautiful um so i'm just gonna pull one more card 
show me some final messages because I'm feeling like y'all y'all are smoking a lot of weed and Ace of Wands did come out or your or the people in your house smoke a lot of weed something because I just feel like this reading is like so mm. thank you the grim reaper the relationship is over no second chances grow and transform your life period damn you may have been engaged to this person or this person may try to like propose Thank you for the final message. Healing heart. Healing from heartbreak. Freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Cupid's arrow. Have faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation or meeting. Love is coming in the form of self-love and all love that is unfiltered. Okay? And true. All right? And that's the mountain. That's the sacrifice that needs to be taken. All right? And that's why you need to know that your team is with you. Okay? You are supported. You are loved. You are divinely guided. All right, Pisces? I love each and every one of you. Again, if you're interested in a personal session, please don't hesitate to click the link in the description box below. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.